Good morning, everyone. Today, we're going to be answering the most requested question I've gotten in the past couple weeks, and that is, Caro, is NGS dying? And my honest answer is, I don't care. And so some of you guys are probably freaking out, going like, oh my god, Carol has inside information, he doesn't care, the game is dying, whoa, the game's gonna die now, oh my god. But before I continue on with the video, if you're new to the channel, I upload NGS content daily, so if you do play this game, I would really appreciate a subscribe, as it really helps out the channel. Anyway, without further ado, let's begin the video. All right, before I induce mass panic among the masses, let me explain why I don't care. For all the video games that I play, that I upload on the channel, that I stream, that I share my socials, all of these games are games that I personally enjoy. They might not be the most popular games, you know, I know a PSO2 NGS is not the most popular game. It's a very niche game. There's not a lot of people who know about this game and there's tons of people who find out about it and they're like, holy crap, how have I not heard of this game ever before? And so I already understand that, hey, my YouTube channel is catered to a very small community in the MMO genre or just in the gaming genre in general. Like if I wanted views, I should be covering, you know, Genshin Impact, League of Legends, all of these other bigger games with much bigger player bases so that I can get all the views and grow my channel. However, your boy Caro is a very selfish person. He plays for fun. I only play games when I have fun playing them. If I don't have fun, I don't play them. It's that simple. So PSO2 NGS, why don't I care if the game dies or not? Because I am having fun playing the game, so I'm gonna continue to play the game. I don't care about people on Twitter going like, Oh my god, the game's gonna die! Look at the Steam charts, it's only got 2,000 active players! Oh, what the hell? Like, so? I don't care. As long as the servers are still online, I'm still able to play the game and I'm having fun personally? That's all that matters. That's it. I don't care about some random person on the internet saying that the game's gonna die because they have a fraction of the statistics going like, oh my god, this is the end all be all. This game is over. I'm leaving. Like, by all means, leave. There's no value in constantly bashing a game that you really hate, but you still play it. That's just... That's just crazy. That's really... That's like insanity or something, right? Like, I don't really understand the point of hating on a game but still playing it. Like, if you hate it, then just don't play it, right? If you want to do something that you really hate, at the very least get paid for it, right? Like, go get a job. You can hate your job. A lot of people hate their jobs, but at the very least, they get paid money for it. And then they can use that money to spend it on stuff that they actually enjoy and they actually like. So it balances out, you know? You do something you hate, you get money, you use the money to buy something you like. But in the case of most video games, if you hate a game and you're spending your free time and maybe money on that game, like that that's like that doesn't make sense. You're paying money on something that you don't like. Like what? So, you know, it's it really baffles my mind. I don't really understand this train of thought. And so all of those discussions and arguments and posts and stuff like that on Twitter and social media about people going like, oh, NGS is gonna die, it's gonna suck, blah, 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 blah. Like, I'm just like, oh, okay, sure, R right? That, that's your opinion, I can respect that. And uh, cool story, bro. But, you know, at the end of the day, is it gonna affect my enjoyment of the game? No, I don't care. Because I'm having fun playing the game, so I'm gonna continue playing the game. And if I don't enjoy playing the game, I'm gonna go off and play something else, and I'll cover something else on the channel. It's very, very simple. As I said earlier, your boy Carol is a very selfish person. He plays for fun, and he only plays for fun. So with that being said, I wanna transition to another topic, and that is, of course, the NGS official creators. This was another topic that went, like, I, I don't really understand why Twitter went crazy and ballistic about it but the TLDR was like oh my god people are going to use these NGS content creator tag thingies to brag and say they're superior over everyone else and literally if you look at Twitter right now all of the NGS creators are literally using these tags for memes. That's it. We're literally just, it's a joke. If you are in the line of content creation, it's very, very difficult to take yourself too seriously. And I think most, if not all of the NGS content creators already understand that, that you can't take yourself too seriously when you're covering this game. Because there's a bunch of people that are gonna troll you and they're gonna take the piss out of you. And so you just can't take yourself seriously. And so the key to all of this is literally just have fun and roll with the punches. If people are hating on you, you embrace the hate. But to be perfectly honest, the NGS community is amazing. I want to say 90% of you guys are freaking awesome, super supportive, super wholesome, 
most of the time. But, uh, you know, the community is great in this game. We're a small community, but we're a good community. And so I don't really feel like the NGS creators have anything to worry about. You know, we just continue on with our daily lives. We create content for the game. We have fun with it and everyone else just enjoys our content. And you know, it's a good thing. Honestly, I feel like social media just overemphasizes or makes things dramatic for no reason because there's nothing better to talk about or something. I don't know. But um, yeah, so NGS content creators, you guys are fine. Just don't be a dick. Special thanks to all the members for supporting the channel. It really means a lot to me. Thank you again. But yeah, that's all I wanted to cover in today's video. Hopefully you guys found it interesting. If you did, I would appreciate a like and a subscribe. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye. What can I say except you're welcome for the heat?